Graph y equals x over x squared minus 16 without using the graphing feature of your calculator. To graph this, we will find the horizontal asymptote, vertical asymptotes, the y-intercept, x-intercepts, and the domain and range. We'll set up the graph and create a green box to store graph data. Begin by finding the horizontal asymptote. The degree of the numerator is less than the degree of the denominator. There is a horizontal asymptote at y equals 0 along the x-axis. Draw the horizontal asymptote along the x-axis. Now we'll find the vertical asymptotes. Vertical asymptotes occur at the zeros of the polynomial in the denominator. Write the equation x squared minus 16 equals 0. Factor the difference of squares to get x plus 4 times x minus 4 equals 0. The roots of the equation are x equals negative 4 and positive 4. There are vertical asymptotes at x equals negative 4 and x equals positive 4. Now we'll find the y-intercept. The y-intercept occurs at x equals 0. Plug in 0 for x. This evaluates to 0. The y-intercept occurs at the point 0, 0. Now we'll find the x-intercepts. x-intercepts occur when y equals 0. Plug in 0 for y. Multiply both sides by x squared minus 16. This gives us 0 equals x. The x-intercept occurs at 0, 0. This is the same location as the y-intercept we found earlier. Now we'll find other points. We need to manually find a few points so that we know how to shape the graph. Find a few points in the left region. Now find some points in the middle region. Finally, find some points in the right region. We now have enough information to draw the graph accurately. Finally, we'll state the domain and range. The domain is x belongs to the set of real numbers with the restriction that x cannot equal plus minus 4. The range is y belongs to the set of real numbers.